Hey everybody, welcome back to the Coin Pusher. Today we're doing a $10 million buy-in. They gave us 50 quarters for $10 million. Pretty expensive game, but if we can get it to go, it should, get, it should pay out pretty good, it looks like. They got a huge, humongous wall of chips there. That is like a huge, gigantic wall of chips. It's topped with quarters and, and gold, laced with gold. There's what, three, uh, three, three quarter pyramids up front. There's two little quarter towers on the, on the uh, red shelves. There's a whole bunch of mystery bags in there. So it should pick for a pretty good win, I'm hoping. So wish me luck. Hopefully win a bunch of it. Right there was the last of the quarters though. Let me grab the quarters. Pulled $155,000 on that round and three ounces of gold. Let's keep her going. It'd be nice if I'd quit dropping quarters all down that front of the machine. That would really help out. There's a humongous golden tower back behind this wall. Oh, nice. I think it's going to go here real soon. Hopefully, it'll take all these. This big wall with it. If we don't already have the wall down by then. Oh, nice. It dropped a gold bar out of it. Oh, my goodness. A couple of them towers are leaning pretty good on that wall. Nice. That'll help out a bunch. Oh yeah, now you can see it. Wow, we well, got to see it for like a half second, like a split second, and then it all just tumbled on into the pay. Goodness gracious! Wow. Well, that was the last of the quarters. Let me grab the quarters. Uh, we'll tally that up for you, and then we'll get right back to pushing. A little over two million dollars on that round. Technically, I think it was like two million two hundred and sixty-five thousand dollars, and a whole bunch of gold and like an entire truckload full of gold. It's doing really good. Oh, and we got a mystery bag. I can't believe all that just like toppled over at the same time. A whole bunch about to go in the right. Oh yeah. Definitely raining gold, that's for sure. Wow. This, this might be a new world record on gold. Hard to say. It's a bunch. We start looking at up my uh, red shells, decide if we're gonna pay to get them. What's it gonna be? Four, five, there's kind of six towers on there. If we get this one over here, let, that'll knock it down to five towers. So that one, I think it'll fall over if we can get that right corner to go. But uh, there is also a one, two, four mystery bags. On the red shelves. And those are all ten thousand dollar chips on the red shelves, besides the gold and, and some quarters. And mystery bags obviously. Yeah, I, I don't know. It's a toss-up. It's a twenty million dollars. It is four mystery bags though. Yeah, it's probably worth it. It's probably worth twenty million. Most likely. I hope so. Still got a minute or so to, to make up our mind. I'd like to get a little more of this out of here before we uh, call them back and have them reset the machine. It's 
it's less stuff for them to be able to stack up. Oh nice, that right corner is moving, you see it? Ooh, you can't hardly see it. Let me, let me fix that camera. Alright. I'm hoping that's better. Like, really, really high up in the air, so uh, hopefully you're not afraid of heights. If you are just just uh, pretend like we're not really that far up. It's getting ready to go in that right corner. Yeah, baby. Come on. You can do it. Well, I took the old soap grinder over. I, I called my dad. Well, technically, he, he called me. said he'd seen a video where I'd won the stone grinder. And, uh, anyhow... We took it to his house, and uh, he had, goodness, I don't know how many stumps. We did a few at his neighbor's house, and uh, all, all around his property. It must have been, let's see if I can try to count them in my head, how many there was. Two, three, four, seven, eight. I think there was like eight of them that, that we was able to uh, grind. And then he had this ginormous one. I, I wanted to get kind of good at it before I go and show you guys um, a video of me using it. Because, I mean, I, I was not very good. It was bouncing around everywhere. It uh, stopped running a few times because I tried cutting too deep. And anyway, I, I just didn't feel like... Uh, I wanted to look like a fool on uh, uh, recording it, so we'll find someone else that'll need something trimmed or ground up. But uh, he had this great big tree, well, stump, I should say. Great big stump, way bigger than all the rest of them. And I, I just couldn't uh, grind it up. And I, I think what it is is the. Uh, the, te the teeth on the grinder thing are dull. They're not sharp anymore, is what I'm guessing. So, maybe I'll look like a pro if I get those changed out. I got some on order. Should be here. Well, actually, I don't know yet. They didn't, uh, they didn't give me a uh, length of time when they do here. They hadn't even shipped them yet, I just, I just ordered them. So, but when they show up, we'll, if, it, if that fixes the problem, then we'll make a video and put it on the Scrap or Go channel. Oh, nice, that right corner is moving good. Okay. Stay tuned to that. Uh, we're out of quarters though. Let me grab some quarters. I'd, I'd really like to get this over here before we go and pay into 20 million to get to red shells. Well, we technically, we got a mystery bag we need to open. So there might be a green earbud in that. We'll see. Nice. We pulled just a little under $1.5 million on that round. Let's check it out see what we got in this mystery bag. Ooh, it's a golden dice. All right. Well, that's, that's pretty good considering we have got a bunch of gold on this game. A whole bunch. Possibly a new record. We're not sure yet. Uh, I guess that does mean there was no green earbud in here for us. I do have a whole bunch of them back in the lockbox, though, which probably ought to use one. This is when there's no white dice, there's no guarantees that there's any white dice in here either, you know. Honestly, there's no guarantees at all. Until you open it up, you don't know what's in there. I don't, anyways. I can't see through them. But uh, anyhow, we did not pull $10 million worth of chips out of here. Not even close. 
So to spend another 20 million to potentially not get any more um, dice, white dice, would be kind of silly to throw 30 million dollars in the trash, more or less. So we'll, we will use one of our, our free um, green earbuds that we got. So I'm doing those uh, one quarter challenges. We got a bunch of them from doing one quarter challenges. That, because they're worth 18 million dollars more when you when you use them on a 50 quarter game. So normally I'll save them and just pay the two million to get the red shelves on the one quarter games. For, for just times like this, and the last. So technically, we've been trying to save them for the bigger games, like uh, the 100 million or 200 million dollar games, because they currently won't let us use them on those um, unless they're they're one in that particular game. Um, we're uh, hoping one day they'll change their mind on that. So we're just, we're just preparing for it. Oop. I guess you'd call me a prepper. I'm, I'm prepping for uh, the future. In case they raise the price to a normal, uh, like, like all the time it happens to be like super expensive, we'll be ready and prepared for it. Got ten grand on that right side to get out of there. Technically, we don't have to. We we could leave it, but I'd like to get it. Oh yeah, there it is. We got her. All right, I'm gonna call them back here, have them take everything off the red shelves. Uh, we'll turn in that green earbud so it doesn't cost us nothing, and then uh, we'll, we'll get right back to pushing. Alrighty, I'm back. We uh, called them back here. We turned in that green earbud. We did pay $100,000 for the insurance, just in case we lose a bunch of the red shelves. Um, I did lower the camera down a little bit, so we can have it a little bit of ease on that. But the camera's not nearly as tall. So a little closer to earth now. I'm not flying up in the skies no more. Or the uh, clouds. towers are a little shorter than the previous ones that were in there. Some pretty big towers though, honestly. Hopefully it's like a humongous win. It's technically that's like what, five towers and four mystery bags. A uh, whole bunch of gold. Most of it just went right into the pay. Wow. I guess not most of it, but a big portion of it did. It's pretty incredible. I like it when they fall forward. It helps out a bunch. Hopefully these two will do the same. Oh my, we're about to find out. Hopefully the left one will do the same. It almost fell backwards though, did you see it? The one that on the right that just went. Oh nice. We did it. Well we didn't need the insurance after all, but uh, that's alright. Better to have it and not need it than uh, Need it and not have it. Spent a hundred grand. At least they had a peace of mind that whole time. Didn't have to worry too much. We are going to lose ten grand for that rat gutter. Maybe we'll get lucky and get a 1025 chip. 
have another chance of getting that back. The 1025 chips, it's a, it's a real special chip. It, uh, it says $10 on one side and it says $25 on the other side. But anyhow, if we happen to get one, uh, everything that's been falling down in the gutters, we, we call these holes right here. There's one here and, and one right there. We call them the gutters. But anyhow, those everything that falls in there, we don't get none of that. It goes to a separate area. And, uh, but if you turn in the 1025 chip, they'll take all that stuff that's falling down there and put it in the playing field. It's its own separate game. It's pretty neat. Hopefully, there'll be one of those in one of these mystery bags so I can show you. And, uh, if there's not, I think you can pretty much look at any game for the last, pretty much any, any video for the last 30 days or so and it we probably got a 1025 chip. So yesterday's video has one. At the least you could go watch yesterday's video and if, if you don't know what I'm talking about and, and there happens to, if there happens to not be one in this game. But look how much is on the edge. There's a bunch. There's a whole bunch. It's the same thing over here. Oh my goodness. Right a quarter zone. Let me grab some quarters. All right, let's check out one of these mystery bags, see what's in there. Oh, nice. We got a white dice. Nice. So well, that gives us uh, one white dice and one golden dice. So that's going to help out a bunch. We've still got several more mystery bags to open. Oh, my. That was a good push. A whole bunch on the right about to go. Oh my gosh, a whole bunch on the left went also. Wasn't expecting that. Oh sweet, they went a mystery bag. Sides moving forward, getting closer to the edge. Oh yeah, get on up there, buddy. There we go. Ten grand to go. Oh my gosh, this is flying. This game is flying by. That's for sure. Oh yeah, we got her. Nice, let me find the mystery bags. And right here also, huh? Let's check it out. Let's wait for that quarter to stop pushing. Alright. Oh yeah, we got another white dice. So that's good. Let's check this one out. Oh nice, another one. Oh yeah. This one feels real heavy. Check it out, see what it is. Oh sweet. They had one of each. So that gives us what? Four of the white dice and two of the golden dice. That should be a pretty good win, I hope. Uh, anyhow, I'll come back here and I'll set them right back in there. We'll roll them down to here where they land on is what our multipliers are. Alrighty. Let's push these dice on down to that lower shelf. Hopefully they'll land on some great big numbers. We went on everything from two to six. If they happen to land on a one, we can try pushing them. They can flip over to something nicer. But if they fall down the gutters or down the pay chute, we do lose them. So we gotta be cautious of that. The gold looks like they're gonna be up first. So let's see how we're gonna do on our gold. Oh my gosh, a five? Wow. That's pretty good so far. Let's see what else we can get. We need the ones to land on some real nice numbers also. Oh, a two, a two, I'll take a two. It almost flipped over to something else. Looks like maybe a four? Yeah, I was a four. Almost did, that gold did. Almost doesn't count, it's gonna actually do it. And stay there. Oh, we got a six on the one on the right. That white dice. Oh, and a four? Wow, oh, the one, that's a dud. That is a bummer. 
Hopefully this next one does better. Ooh, sweet four, that covers a bunch. All right, well, I'm gonna tally it all together. We'll multiply by that right there and we'll be right back. 6,940,000. Oh my gosh. That dice just flipped over, didn't it? To a better number even. So let me go tally it all up again because that doesn't even matter anymore. Nice, nah, so we ended up pulling six million two hundred and ten thousand dollars out of there. And them dice that totaled it up to fifteen, so we got to multiply it all by fifteen, turned it into an astounding ninety-three million one hundred and fifty thousand dollars. That is incredible. Not to mention we also got two hundred and eleven ounces of gold. And them golden dies totaled up to seven, so we got to multiply it all by seven. Wasn't no world record, but it's still a bunch. 1,477 ounces of gold. All in all, that's not bad for a $10.1 million buy-in. Not bad at all. Well, if y'all enjoy the videos, do me a favor, hit that like button. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed, and we'll see you on the next one. Y'all take care.